This is Mac Voices TV. This edition of Mac Voices TV is brought to you by Rogue Amoeba, makers of fine audio software such as Airfoil. With Airfoil, you can send audio all around your house. That's Airfoil by Rogue Amoeba at rogueamoeba.com. This is Mac Voices TV in San Francisco at Macworld 2011. I'm Chuck Joyner, and we are in the 10-1 booth talking to Peter Skinner about the Macworld Best of Show winning fling. Peter, this is becoming a habit. Yes, second year in a row for Best of Show. We don't know why, but we aren't complaining. I, th I think you said something about uh, it being lucky, and it's either lucky or good, and I think it's probably good. Oh, thanks. Yeah, well, it's hard to say. <laughs> we do our best, though. Well, let's talk about Fling. This is a really nice little idea that you have to create a game controller for the iPad. Yes, thank you. We really wanted to allow iPad gamers, and there's so many of them, to have controls that they can touch and feel. And it really helps you when you have controls you can feel. You feel a lot more immersed in your game. Now, the iPad is a very innovative device. It has an innovative interface. You guys had to come up with something that was even a little more innovative to take advantage of what it offers but for gamers who are used to a certain set of controls. Yeah, that's right. So we took inspiration from the analog joysticks on the PlayStation and the Xbox, and we sort of brought that over to the iPad. And there were some interesting challenges we had to overcome in order to make that happen. But the end result is uh, controls that feel a lot like a dual analog joystick, and uh, in practice will help you break your high scores, which is really cool. Well, can you show us a little bit of it? Because I, I especially like the way it attaches to your iPad. Oh, sure. Yeah, I'll show it to you. So this is uh, the device. It's called Fling. And you place it over top of the joystick on the iPad. And you press down on the suction cups, and it secures to the surface. And then it has a spring mechanism, which gives you the feel that you're used to from your console and all the, and all the same control and precision. And the spring mechanism not only works, but it also looks very cool. It gives the product a really great look stuck to the iPhone, or iPad. Uh, thank you. Yes. Yes, it is an iPad. Um, yes, the spring mechanism, um, we were particularly proud of having a unique look that was also um, essential to the function of the, of the joystick. So it, it's, it's form meets function in, in some sense. Now talk about the interface a little bit because you know this this is an ex, an outboard kind of device for the iPad. How is it communicating with your iPad and with your specific game? So the uh, fling acts as a bridge between your between your thumb and the iPad screen. So what, it's a very simple device, and and all it does is transfer that touch from your thumb down to the screen. Um, and so you'll see uh, as a result you'll see an increase of accuracy, and you also have this great like low friction feeling of playing, where if you've ever had sticky thumbs on iPad glass, you'll know what I'm talking about. So, really, there is no software. It's just using the touch interface itself. That's exactly right. Uh, Fling works with well over 100 games on the App Store already, anything that has a virtual joystick. And we're talking about um, RPGs, um, First-person shooters, space shooters, dual-stick shooters, and a ton of sports games like FIFA and Madden. Very cool. Uh, how about pricing? Uh, uh, Fling is uh, exceptionally well-priced. We're very happy. We recently reduced the price, and it is uh, uh, $19.95 for a single side and uh, $29.95 for a pair for the left and right thumb. That's embarrassingly affordable, especially for real gamers that are really into it on the iPad. Yeah, we think it's a really great investment, and uh, if, if you're cleaning up on, on, uh, on the leaderboards, uh, it's a great feeling, uh, and we, we really uh, we wish everyone good luck in breaking the high scores and beating their friends, and we, we like to say, uh, with Fling, you, you, can tell your fl you can tell your friends, but just don't tell your opponents. Peter, it's a very cool product. I really offer my congratulations on another Best of Show. We'll see you back here for Macworld 2012 and probably another one of those. Yes, let's hope. That would be really fun. <laughs> Thank you. Folks, I'm Chuck Joyner. This is Mac Voices TV at Macworld 2011 in San Francisco. Until the next time, thanks for watching. Voices TV is part of the Mac Voices Group and a member of Mac Level 10.